this variant with these mutations is able to evade the immune response more effectively than prior versions of the virus. So if you've been infected or if you've been vaccinated and you've got some antibodies in your system, those antibodies may not recognize the protein on the surface of the virus as well. So I anticipate we'll see an uptick in cases with this more transmissible virus that's able to evade the immune system. But what I'm really watching are the fall and winter months because that's typically when we see the largest surge in respiratory viruses. With this latest round of variants, this FLIRT variant, the antibodies that you have from past vaccination may not bind and neutralize that virus as well. If you've been infected or vaccinated in the past three to four months, you probably are going to have antibodies that are going to recognize these newer viruses pretty effectively. And for sure will help you keep from getting really, really sick, may even help prevent you from coming down with any symptoms at all. If you were infected or vaccinated more than six months ago, you may not have as good of protection and you may come down with a subsequent infection uh, with the typical symptoms of COVID. Getting the most up-to-date vaccination is really important because if you haven't been vaccinated since 2021, 2022, you probably don't have the immune response that's going to protect you from the newer strains.